Hello guys, welcome to Swift Communication here. Sending files from your iPhone to your laptop can sometimes be difficult. In this video, I'll show you guys one of the fastest and most simplest ways to send files from your iPhone to your Windows laptop. Before I continue with the video, please click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification. In this video, I'll be using a hit to airline to 1030 GT. And I'll be transferring the files from the iPhone 12 Pro Max. So first, you have to install the software for this. You open your browser and you search for three U tools. Click on the first link. And click on the download button. The file is around 116 megabytes. It's done downloading, so now you install it onto your laptop. Click on yes, install. Then we launch the application. So now you need a lightning to type two cable, a USB A to lightning cable. Any of these cables will do the work. Our laptop has a type C port. So you can use the type C to lightning cable. But in case you don't have the type C port, then use the regular USB cable to lightning. So you plug in this end to the iPhone. So now you open the 3D2. It's showing us that our hotspot is on. So let's turn off the hotspot. And you reconnect the device again. And this app, you can see all the specifications of your iPhone. The iOS version, the serial number, the AMEI. You can also use this app to back up or restore. Also, to restart your iPhone in case it freezes. What we'll be doing today is to transfer photos on the iPhone to the laptop. So, with that, you go to Photos. This app can also be used to import pictures. In case you have pictures on your laptop, you want it to come to your iPhone. Or you have pictures on your iPhone, you want it to go to the laptop. Our storage on the iPhone is almost full. So now you select the files you want to export to the laptop. We are exporting all the pictures. We've highlighted 15 pictures, then you click on the export button. Then you select the folder you want the files to be on your laptop. So we'll put the files on the download folder. Then you press OK. So now we are done transferring the files from the iPhone to the laptop. When we open the downloads folder, you can see the files on the downloads folder. These are the files. Now I'll show you guys how to import pictures. How to import the pictures on the laptop to the iPhone. So you can see the import photo button. You click on it. You select if it's a file or a folder. Now we are transferring files. 
we select the location of the file on the laptop. The files we are transferring today is a Swift folder. So we'll transfer three videos. When you're done selecting the items you want to import, to click on open. So now you need to install a PIC2 app on your device. If it's not installed already, the app will install it for you. But we have already installed the PIC2 app. So you just need to open the app. So once you open it, all the files will import automatically. That was very fast. Now the videos we imported is on the camera roll on the iPhone. You can also use this app to restart your phone in case it freezes. You just have to click on the reboot button and your iPhone will restart in seconds. Our iPhone is done restarting. That was fast. So now the app is requesting us to unlock the iPhone. You can also use this app to back up or restore the files on your iPhone. Let me show you guys how to back up the file. So you click on the backup through transfer. Then you wait till the backup is completed. We have a lot of files on our iPhone, so that will take around 2 hours to finish complete. 